In Chicago business, the midday numbers. John has the Wind Trust Business Lunch now. Money, 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 money. Now, welcome to the show. This is John Williams, and this is the Wind Trust Business Lunch on WGN Radio. WGN Radio News in seven minutes. Let's spend much of that with the folks from Echo, the company that Ryan Ladley is the vice president of operations of. They're in Lake Zurich. They employ over a thousand folks, and as I understand it, are celebrating an anniversary this year. Uh, welcome to the show, Ryan. What's the anniversary? Oh well, hey, thanks for having me, John. Sure. The uh, 50th anniversary is something we are very, very excited about. Um, it give you a little background of, of Echo. We are your hometown landscape equipment manufacturer, located right here in Lake Zurich. And we produce things such as lawnmowers, chainsaws, leaf blowers, trimmers, both for professionals and consumers. And you touched on the 50th anniversary, which is really excited for us. It's this month, actually, in November. And uh, if you don't mind, to give you a little bit of history, 12 people back in 1972 started this company as a distribution company only. Hmm. We are now... Lake Zurich's largest employer with over a thousand people in manufacturing, automation, assembly, and machining. It's been such an exciting growth over the past 50 years. I've seen your stuff. Um, It's at Home Depot too, right? It is. Uh, You can get our product at Home Depot or over 6,000 independent dealers as well. Absolutely. And uh, do I understand that you guys are a pretty green company as well? We are. Um, One of our core values is environmental sustainability. So we have always focused on our green initiative. We've always valued that, but we have accelerated those efforts over the past 10 years. Just to give you a couple of examples, we recently installed a 2.8 million watt solar power system on the roof of our Echo facility. And this went live in June of this year. We are able to offset 40% of our overall energy usage, and we return that to the grid. I also want to mention that we capture 100% of our plastic resin waste. This keeps 400,000 pounds Mm. of plastic resin out of landfills every single year. And to take it even one step further, we even repelletize the dust that's created from the (laughs) regrind process. I didn't know you could do that. Ryan Ladley is with Echo. Uh, incorporated. What's the best seller? What do you guys sell the most of, Ryan? What's your standard? Well, trimmers and blowers. Uh, We sell a lot of trimmers and blowers, um, but we've got a great mix of products. Um, And to be honest with you, we've really expanded our lineup past just the gas. We now have, we're really excited to bring in a new E-Force 56-volt line of battery products. Um, And that's something very exciting. We're changing with the times and making sure that, you know, we listen to the voice of the customer. You know, whether they need battery product for a a municipality or a high torque trimmer or a a more powerful backpack blower or a lighter weight edge trimmer. So we design these products to meet their needs. So it not only helps the customer, but the communities they serve as well. I like doing lawn work. I talk about it now and again on the radio. You know, the the gadget I need the most, the thing that I I most want to do, but I find the most difficult to do is uh, edging the lawn between the grass in the sidewalk. I like a nice little trough there. And that is a son of a gun of a job to do. We, we have a couple of great products for you right there. We have some outstanding edgers and, and the stick edger is one of our also world's first. We've got a lot of innovation in product, but we have the right product for you, John. And um, you guys are the, uh, were you guys the leaders or the innovators of the backpack blower as well? Yes, we were. So back in 1975, we actually invented the first backpack blower. Fast forward three years, we then invented the handheld blower in 1978. And now pretty much every landscape crew Mm -hmm. and most homeowners have it either in their garage or their truck or their trailer. And we have since introduced the first low noise blower. And we are really, really proud to offer the world's most powerful backpack blower in the industry and as i mentioned you know earlier introducing a new e-force 56 volt line of battery products 
is something that we're very, very excited about this year to give our users another option, especially as times are transitioning. Well, a low noise lawn implement is innovation because that's just the sound of spring, summer, and fall as all of those things were in a way. If you can make them quieter, I think the neighborhood will thank you. Absolutely. <laughs> That's the goal. And you realize with HOAs and municipalities yeah. and changing that, yeah. not only do we have low noise gas blowers, but we've got a very quiet line of 56 volt battery products as well. So we want to make sure that we listen to the voice of our end users. And that's really critical for us. Ryan Ladley is the Vice President of Operations at Echo Incorporated, ECHO. You see them at their own stores. You see them at Home Depot and places like that. They employ over 1,000 people in Lake Zurich, and their birthday is this month. Happy 50-year anniversary. My best to all of the folks over there, Ryan. Oh, well, thank you so much, John. You have a good day.